Cedric is, I mean, I've, I've been a fan of his for so long and I've met him here and there, but like him coming in and taking like, that's such a great example of like what we thought it was gonna be and then him just blowing that up. Just blowing it up and saying things and just his whole, the whole tone he gave to that part, like he just crushed that. She's a really smart woman and she edits lines. She, she just can kind of cut around in a scene and she always makes it a little better. She speaks to children the same way, you know, she speaks to a, a room full of adults. And I kind of, I really loved playing that. I, I felt terrible sometimes filming it. And I would often apologize and say, this is a fictitious character. We would normally not speak like this and don't say what I'm s saying. And I'm sorry to the parents. I think I felt much more, everybody else like, oh, it's fine. I'm like, is it? He's so kind and he's a, he's a really mellow, smart guy. And it, he just runs a really collaborative, really fun set. So everybody's kind of, it's, you know, it's free and easy to say a line, say a whole, if you have a whole new idea, like you, he wants to hear it, I want to hear it. And I think when you can run a set that loose and happy, a lot of good stuff happens. We were sitting around a table, the three of us, and I said, what if there's just a brutal fight? like a brutal Braveheart style fight, but I fight children. And they were like, ah, I don't know if you, like you wanna hit kids? I was like, yeah. Michelle Darnell is a character that I did originally like 14, 15 years ago at the Groundlings Theater. And she just stuck with me. I just thought she was, I mean, unstoppable.